sorry about that. I was just making sure the audio was working. <laughs> um, so yeah, I uh, just wanted to show you uh, what I have in there. I, I used it as my purse yesterday, which I usually don't do, but um, to start out with, easily grabbable. You can see I have my knife, which I'll take out for you guys since it's YouTube. Don't monetize me, don't report me, but this is what it looks like. It's very sharp. Um, that's why it's in a sheath type of thing. Um, and it's for just in case they get caught in um, any type of trap or if I need to stabby stab stab something or if I need to cut down wood or something like that to make fire. Um, and then I have my bear spray, just your generic bear spray. Um, somebody just passed by my car. Uh, and then today I had gloves just because the trail I went on, we were about an hour and a half and it was really cold this morning. It was about 30. So I don't need those in there right now. Um, I ideally usually have a, like a, a bag of little treats or something for the dogs. Cause I do like to reward them when they come back to me, if I have to call them. Um, let me see if I can point you guys down. Eh, it doesn't want to point down but there we go so you can see sorry i'm just in my car right now we're uh we're just hanging out um and then i have uh, a roll of quarters and a lighter uh just in case i do get lost and i need to you know pay for a, a phone like an emergency phone uh which they still have on the side of the roads usually and then a lighter obviously i have a flint too but lighters if they have they're so much easier um i haven't had to open this but i do have a little survival kit right here um you can see on the back all the stuff that it has it's just easier than carrying my um and it's easier than carrying like all my survival gear because i do have a bunch of it but it has like a um it has matches it has a whistle as a compass it has a fire cube which is um you can like it'll keep your fire it has a sewing kit it has tea it has uh, bandages um and it has cold preps it has duct tape in there it has um yeah just a bunch of stuff it has a couple of band-aids and then speaking of band-aids i have my bandage little kit again i have much more than this but this is just like a cleaning and band-aids just in case i get cut or the dogs get cut or something um i have my extra mask in here which i don't really need that that's my growling one so i'll put that away um and then again i was using this as my purse yesterday so i will carry my wallet actually that's a good point i'll carry my wallet because um if somebody breaks into my car i don't want them to steal my id in my wallet um i got my taser this is just a silicone pack i got my taser in there I have my, and then, oh, I have my necklace. I was, I just bought this necklace. I was like, where did it go? It's a paw print. Um, and then I have also my switchblade, which has, um, it's kind of dirty, but it has little scissors. It has a little light on it, as you can see. Um, I've had this one for years and years. This one's probably over 10 years old. So I probably need to put more batteries in that light, but, um, my hands are really cold, but it has like, you know, little knives, things that normal switch blades have. Um, I have, I carry a lot of weaponry as you can see, but I have my other knife, um, which is actually more of a, like a cutting, um, which is again, very sharp. Have to be very careful with that. Um, again, I usually have some type of dog food. Um, and water in here, but I did drink the water and um, I have to replace the dog food. Um, and then I have a granola bar usually hanging out in there, but that has all been consumed. So I have to put it back in. Then I have emergency rope with a carabiner, uh, just in case I need to hang things up. Uh, I can be used as a tourniquet. I can be used if I have to climb up something or get stuck somewhere. It's very good. Um, then I have my binoculars just in case we see some wildlife. Um, and then I have this thing. I have some gum also in the front pocket. We're in the front pocket now. Um, and then I have, once again, we have another fucking switchblade. And this is, um, will cut off um, wire. It's, again, it's dirty. I had um, my granola bar, I only ate half of it. And it was one of those nature grain bars that got fucking everywhere. Um, 
and then this will break windows. It's very hard to break windows, but it's better than using your hand. Then I have this. I'm not going to set it off because it's very painful, but it's a it's an alarm. So you pull it. It makes this really loud, really loud, scary noise. It scares the dogs. It, it hurts my ears, but it's really good to have something like that for uh, bears. So I've been keeping that really handy. Um, and I'm probably going to see, you know, what I need, what I don't need. But yeah, the only thing I didn't show you is I'll either carry some dog treats or dog food or emergency. So, um, or in, in water for both of us. Um, but yeah, I hope that was kind of interesting for you guys and I'll talk to you later. Uh, bye bye fish stick wheel man.